boy in our E man right now. When it comes to HD, we that title subscription. We on title, man. You can catch us early over there. Title.com forward slash drink champs. Six days off. Let's go. And we might give you a, a deal if you say you could cl- cut my toenails. Don't do it. One love. <laughs> What it good be? Hopefully it's what it should be. This is your boy N A O N A A. What up? It's DJ E F N in English. And this is Chick Chats. <laughs> Motherfucking Yappy Hour. Make some <laughs> And right now, we not only have a friend on the show. I think this is his third time here. I believe it's his third time here. Yeah. Family. Definitely family. One yeah. of the nicest black slash Puerto Rican nigga Ricans in the world. But you, but you niggas get to get it when we had it. He says it, oh la la. That's how yeah, he came I didn't out. know you know Lithuanian. That's how he came out. You know, in the game, relentless, part of a legendary group. Still here. They just got for tour. Still out here counting dollars, man. Like Eric Sherman and Paris Smith. Mm. Shout out to Shit Eric is Sherman. real. If you don't know who the fuck we talking about, we talking about the legendary none other than the one and only Petey Crack Cocaine hey! Mason. Hey! Let me pick up the shine papers because you know we got them, them shine blunts rolled up. And but uh, right now we're going to go with the smoke champs. This looks smoke like cocaine. Um, Get in California it is right not. now. It is not. Yeah, it's a white powdery. Uh, mm. nah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't. It's a white powdery nah, shit on that. No narcos <laughs> attached to it. Nah, nah, nah. I'm fucking with you. And be crack. You, 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 your family. I would like to say. I would like to apologize for you. Don't. I have to say why. Don't say why. Okay. Don't. I'm asking. Should I say why? I don't want you to say okay, why. Okay, right, cool, cool. But well, I just apologize because, you know, I always, sometimes I joke with you and I don't know if you, you took it serious or whatever. You know you're my family. The last episode? You talking about last episode? I don't even remember. He, I don't know. He just was mad at me. He didn't call me for six months. No, 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 no. Was it when I went to sleep? Let me tell you this. When I went to sleep? No, let me tell you this, though. Look, I, I told him why I was mad and shit. And he, uh-huh. had, he, uh, he apologized right there on the spot. He's like, yo, you know what, my brother? I ain't mean to do like this, like that. That's but true. I was a little drunk when that happened. Right. When I, he All called me. Right. So, no, I'm saying yeah. well, the apology right, happened. Right, right. When that happened. Oh. So I accepted it too fast. <laughs> and then when I sobered up, I was thinking about it. I was like, no, I was like, fuck that. So look, you took back. He, he I took, took it back. back. He took it back. So he hit me. He hit me again. He like, yo, crack it up. I'm like, yo, I'm gonna keep it real with you. No, I'm like, yo, I'm still mad at you, my nigga. He was like, but I apologize about that. I'm like, no, now I take it back. Remember, I was like, damn, I ain't never heard of him. No, yeah, he didn't even get mad. He didn't get mad at me. He was like. You know what? He's just like, yo, you know time. what? You got that crack. Yeah, I'm gonna jam. And when you said that, dog, I was just like, damn. Nah, nah, nah because you know why? Hell. You know why? Sometimes um, I had to learn that as being a media. Sometimes I'll play with you as if it's off off camera, Word. and yeah. I'm not realizing. You're going you know too far, maybe sometimes. Yeah, um, well, not. I don't. Cause, cause if it was something that I wouldn't play with him, right? On, um, off camera, then I was going too far. But you know, I know this nigga. Like, you know, what I'm saying, like, you know what I mean? I like, think that's what it is. Cause you yeah. are man so much. It's just right. like, come on, crack me. You don't fuck with you. Yeah. I'm like, you fucking with me in front yeah. of millions yeah, of motherfuckers. Yeah, I didn't know that. I didn't, I didn't realize that. <laughs> it's so all goody, man. As a, as a man, you know what I mean? Like, I, I like to do that. And another reason why, one of the other reasons why I wanted you on here is because uh, there's been a lot of talk on our show, a lot of talk in general in social media about what they call blackballing, right? Mm. Now, um, from what I'm gathering, like, they, they think that, you know, uh, Jay-Z and... Puff Daddy and they get together and they tell us the what, Illuminati. what guests to put on our show <laughs> right. and what mm-hmm. guests not to put on our show. Which is not true. And at it's all. getting out of it's, it's getting out of control. Yeah. So you're one of the prime candidates because you had, you know, uh a so called so called, you know, a uh, 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 drama with, with with some of these individuals. No doubt. But we ain't gonna start there. Yeah. We're not gonna start there. You do we have a different platform, different fans. So what I would like to do, I wanna take it from the beginning. Mm-hmm. North Philadelphia, correct? Exactly. So Will Smith and you from the same hood? No, he's from West Philly. Oh, he, he ain't say North Philadelphia. No, he born said in West Philadelphia. Oh, West Philadelphia. Oh, West Philadelphia. He got yeah. me. Yeah. He, he got, got me. me. And, and where, where are the, most of the roots from? Uh, damn, you got me. I know Black Thought from South Philly. South Philly. South Philly. Cause you mess with the roots as well. I mess with them yeah, heavy, yeah. yeah but mm-hmm. there's so many of them that mainly I know. I know we're definitely uh, black from South, but the rest mm-hmm. of them, there's so many people. They from different parts. Right. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? But to give you an idea, like Will Smith, like West Philly from North Philly would be almost equivalent to like from driving from Manhattan to uh, Brooklyn. Oh, that so that's distance. close. That's, 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 that's close that's enough. Close, yeah, it's like 20 you minutes. You ain't like, walking still, there. You it's ain't a different walking. world. The separation world. is mm. further enough for mm. niggas to be different here. Right, like, yeah, it's absolutely. a West Philly nigga. Right. And then it's South Philly niggas. Right. And it really means something. You know what I'm saying? Right. To somebody else, Philly niggas is Philly niggas. But to right. us, 
Of course. That's a South Philly nigga. Oh, yo, that nigga from West. Right. There's a big like us difference. Brooklyn and Queens and shit like that. You can recognize it. You, you can <laughs> right. see a Brooklyn nigga walking like, yo, that nigga from Brooklyn. Right, right. Yeah, every so city got that. Every city. So, yeah, even so, in Miami, we got so that. So you from um, <coughs> North Philly? From North, yeah. Well, <coughs> so how did you even start to uh, get involved with rapping and rhyming? Um, Honestly, man, I think the first time I started the one to rap was... Uh, what you mean? What turned me on to hip hop, or yeah. when I really started even putting the pen to the no, pad? No, no. Let's start with what turned you on to hip hop. Yeah. All right. Well, okay. I used to live with my grandma when I was a kid. You mm. know what I'm saying? About three, mm. four, five, six. Throughout them years, when we were real little, we all mm. lived with our grandma. Right. Mm. So uh, my uncle ran that time when I was that this age. Is it Puerto Rican side? This is my black side. Okay. Mm. So oh, I got not that one. You, you sure? <laughs> yeah, not that one. No, nah, this, this one. Come and on. That, that's a good one too. This one. Yeah, but not that one. That's still smoke change. That's a coated one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you was a non coated smoke. <laughs> let's, let's the, it look a little crazy. It look a little crazy. Put the regular one yeah, on I like, That's why I like smoking it, man. I like smoking it because it look crazy. Yo, you like fucking with me. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> yeah. Yo, so anyway, my uncle, he was around about, he's a teenager. Uh-huh. So as I'm a kid and I got, he's running around the house, going to high school and shit. And he's listening to all the dope shit, buying all of the sneaks, the Patrick Ewans right. and all of that. Right. So I'm absorbing what he's doing. You know what I mean? You know, mm-hmm. I was like your big brother, but he, my uh-huh. uncle was like my big brother. Right. Uh-huh. So I'm listening to all of this Run DMC shit and Slick Rick and all of that. So after a while, uh, I got my own radio and he would start lending me tapes. Like he would let me hold a tape. Once, so you got your own radio show? No, oh, no. Nah, nah, nah. nah. my, okay, okay. my mom brought me a little one cassette deck tape mm, when right. I was a kid. I have this is my first radio. Mm. So uh, before I had a tape, I would have blank tapes and I would just wait for the radio shows to come on, like the hot, like Lady B that play all the hip hop shit, and I would just keep my shit. Philly mix shows. Yeah. Philly mix shows. Right. And you'll put, I, I didn't know who no, the fuck that was. I'm yeah, sorry. Lady B the shit I'm sorry. though. We love you. We love you right now. Shout out to Lady B. Big up Lady B. But you would put your shit on record, then pause. So all you gotta do is hit the pause button. You don't remember uh, that? Oh, you make yeah, pause yeah. tapes. I used to make pause tapes. Yeah, yeah. All right, but I'm a little kid, don't you? And it goes right through. You still exactly. make pause tapes right yeah. now. Come on. So anyway, <laughs> yeah. so anyway I, I think I graduated from that. He seen I start doing that shit, so he just started giving me tapes. He gave me one tape at a time. It's your and uncle. Every tape he'd give me, I would memorize it. Like I, the, I knew the whole Run DMC album. Mm. Every album I knew. All the mm. LL shit. Mm. Ultra Magnetic MCs. I knew mm. every word because I only had one tape. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So one day I popped his shit. One day I popped it and I remember I didn't know what to do because I was frantic because he always so warned me like, you didn't a taste the tape. joint? You didn't even fix it? I put the tape on it but yeah. then, you know, once he probably played it and got to that part it and it probably was like, no, it's probably just do some weird shit like, right. 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 and then it get back to the shit. Right. So he's like, yo, you pop my shit, man. Right. Don't ask me for no more fucking tapes. Right. Right. So that was my relation. That was my day. introduction, though, to just hip hop. Ever since then, I just always been just in search. Uh, um, but what, what made you want to actually like you be a part of it? Like you be. be but what, but wait, but was there any Philly artists that you started to hear before you started running? Yo, honestly, I'm glad it's a good thing you asked me that. This is one of the main reasons I think that made me feel a little bit that I could do it myself. Because before it was just like niggas on TV. I'm like, yo, I can't. I I like that, but I don't think I could do that. All the right. niggas from New York, nobody was from Philly. Right. I've never seen a real rapper in person. They was like, right. it was like it wasn't even real people to me. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Until yeah. it was this group called Tough Crew. Mm. Tough North Crew's, Philly. In Miami, they were big. Just Yo, in the skating they ring. They had to drink my part my of town. My part of town was the, oh, the, the I'm glad you know what I'm talking oh, about. Man. Tough Crew. Because this nigga would have had them looking like some bulls. Way over there. My part of town is yeah. like a, it's, it's, it's an yeah. anthem. It's okay. an anthem. All right. So, no doubt. So, uh, they had a big hit, my part huge, of town. Huge. And right. They was right from my hood. So they all, when they got signed, they all bought all these Suzuki sidekicks. Mm. And that's when they was the shit, the little box uh-huh. drinks. Yeah. So they had a black one, a white one, a red one. Mm. So we would always wait for to see the Suzuki sidekick. And it would come through the block. Right. And I would see them, you know what I'm saying? So now it's real to me. Mm. And I just started feeling like, yo, I want to do that. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'll mm. be practicing, acting like I'm Ice Dog. I think the lead, I don't know, I think. The lead singer is Ice Dog. He was like mm. my fucking idol. You know what I'm saying? Mm, right. So I be practicing thinking I'm him. And uh, I don't know. I just started, it started getting in my system. I just stopped fucking with school. You know what I'm saying? Right. I just started fucking with the music heavy. And, and we learned the last time that you guys in State Property, you guys actually didn't <coughs> grow up together. Nah, That don't. was something that was like a, 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 a I didn't know any of them. Wow. We just all from Philly. You know what I'm saying? So it made it easy to put us together because we all from the same... We all right. got the same vibe. I mean, we know right. the time. But right. who put y'all together? Uh, I think Beans, Beans and Dane kind of put it together. You know what I'm saying? Beans right. mainly put it together. 
Because right. the group was together before me. So I believe he the one who kind of put it together. I guess the label might have helped him put it together. I don't know the yeah, details. Yeah, like the first hardcore I know boy band. Right. From Philly, I mean. <laughs> well, well, Wu-Tang got to be the first one if that's the I case. mean, but they kind of knew each other already. Yeah, that's true. I'm saying boy band, you know, like the, like the, meaning the they stigma. Just put it they together, put it together. Yeah. It's a okay, hardcore okay. boy yeah. band. Yeah. But the only one that knew, I only knew Freeway. Me and Freeway knew each other. Okay. With the, to, to school? For, for years. Like, no, nah, we grew up two blocks apart. Both oh, with wow. our grandma. You know what I mean? Wow. So he lived in one block. I lived the next block down the street. So we seen each other since we was like six, seven. We all went to high school together. Mm. We was in little rap groups and shit, talent shows and showcases mm. and all of that little process you mm. go through throughout your right. teenage years, rapping and shit. So it's you just... want us to pop the bottle for you? I wanted to get a little colder, but... Come on, man. Come on. Yeah, yeah why not? Man. You want to buy it? Come on, Mr. Lee. Don't shoot you nobody. Know all right. Come on. Mr. Lee don't know how to pop. So, um... <laughs> yeah, man. What's she up? be sound like a shootout out here, goddammit. <laughs> so, all right. Last time you was here, we got to ask this. This is What's a big good? elephant in the room. You were with old Millie, right? Is that is that a... Oskino. Yeah. Yeah, you Oskino. stay calling yeah, you niggas. said Omelio Spark? No, yeah. he said Omelio Meek cousin. Yo, oh, you be oh, fucking I'm, everybody uh, shit Come up. on, I'm dyslexic, man. I'm uh, dyslexic, man. I'm uh, dyslexic. Uh, What's my homie, oh, my homie name, his name? Oskino. 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 Yeah, Oskino, yeah. So last time you came, you came with Oskino. Yeah. It was a little bit of friction. Right. Um, between um, y'all? No, no, not between us. State between, property between and state oh, property, oh, okay. and, and then now we don't see him around, but now we see state property. We see everyone basically, basically around. I told you, right. basically around, um, but him. Yeah. How, how did the situation get to that? Oh, thank you, bro. Appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. We got cups. Yeah, that ain't your cup right there. Right there. No, nah, I mean I got some other shit in here. Oh, okay. All right, cool. Get him I think you got. Is that empty right there? Right. Yeah, give him a, give him Y'all a, clean this. This has some shit in it. <laughs> that real style. That real style. Where's the plastic cup, man? What There's the some fuck, shit man? in that cup. <laughs> Yo, it's that. It's Yo, that. what happened to the plastic cups y'all went to the store for? What the fuck? Yo, I right, want to get his. Give me no look. plastic cups. Jesus, give me two. Appreciate it. Go ahead. Two. Two. Nah, so look, around that time, right? Uh huh. That was when. Uh, I was trying to keep it, not trying to, I was keeping it just regular with everybody. Right. O had a big issue with a couple members out the group, you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. But at the end of the day, I still had mad love for O, mad love for the group, and uh-huh. I'm just feeling like it was going to brush over or whatever. I really didn't give a fuck. I'm like, yo, O my man, so I'm like, yo, you work that out with them, and I'm still going to be me. I thought that was dope that we could go places like here, uh-huh. and he could feel the way he feel, and I feel right. the way I feel. And we just not both here barking like Y'all you like. Y'all be individual. Yeah, you like. Right. Oh, that's how old feel. Crack, how you feel? I'm like, I don't feel that way, but that's how I feel. I respect it and let that be that. Right. But then after a while, uh, um, it just started getting out of hand. Twin, what up, baby? It yeah. start it start getting out of hand a little bit. I think like the friction online and all of that. Right. And uh, I think we did another show after that, like another big show. Uh-huh. I don't say the name. Uh-huh. We did another show, and then he got into that again with them a little bit, and I'm just right. like, yo, you know what? To each his own. Oh, if you feel that way, unless you feel that way, I ain't gonna continue to keep doing this. I'm saying, so, going so over. where did that leave y'all relationship at? Um, it kind of just started to fickle away, man. Cause you know how it is, man. Uh, right. It's like I can't play the middle too much. Right. And then when the when the tour came, I'm like, fuck it. I don't feel as harsh as you feel. I still right. fuck around. I still go on tour and bust this move. Right. They still the brothers to me. You know what I'm saying? Regardless, so. I kind of slid, me and old slid, kind of gracefully slid. It wasn't no big issue. We never beefed. You never seen us mm-hmm. arguing and shit, but we both know, like, yo, it is what it is. All right, I'm going to go my way. You go your way. And that's how that went about. So that's when I just said, fuck it, and bust the tour move. I yeah. wish we all could have just said, fuck it, that and all my, back, that, went back on tour. But I knew it wasn't work that way because old so that's headstrong. That's crazy. That's my next question. You know, he's yeah. so headstrong that... Uh, he one of them niggas, man. He remind me of Tupac. It's like it's impossible to make him feel the way you want him to feel. He gonna yeah. feel and you gotta respect it. So you know the open twice. kept it moving, man. Oh. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. So um, I so because yeah, you know in the beginning seeing y'all all together, I just felt like it was like inseparable. Like sometimes you like I don't know if you watched the Wu Tang documentary. Mm-hmm. Um, no, I didn't get you yet. Which needs I want to be a to documentary on, on state props. Yeah, you I believe it will be. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. Well, in the Wu Tang documentary, when you see like discrepancies and you see like certain things that you know you guys hid, they hid from us. Like mm-hmm. you know, like for years we had mad shit for years. Yeah, yeah. Everybody, that's, it that's was entertainment. Business. There's always been issues and friction and motherfucking um. Yo, that blunt is doing some wild shit right now. <laughs> 
Yeah. What's going shit? on? That shit is sizzling around, right? Look yeah, at that shit. what's happening? Yeah. That's that smoke chance, baby. Yeah, that's that smoke chance, baby. Only available in California. Yeah. Right? Yeah, only available in California. If you're right in California. From over there. If you're in California, this got CBD. We in California. Around you. Yeah, we in California in our minds, God damn it, In our minds. So, um. What's up? Like, you know, looking from the outside in, um. You ever thought you could? You ever you ever thought that like you guys would even go through this type of turmoil? Because obviously you guys didn't know each other, but when you got with each other, you became brothers. At one point, everybody was brothers. Yeah, mm-hmm. and then to go through it, which it, woo, pick up some shine papers, fall on the table. So at one point, you guys are brothers, and then and then and repping for the city. Yeah, I'm sure that. So did I ever think that that you guys? Yeah. Um, honestly, me, because I be analyzing characters and shit and analyzing personalities and shit, I kind of knew a long time ago that, like, yo, that I knew that I, uh, that I wouldn't be going for certain shit. There was a lot of shit I wasn't feeling, you know what I'm saying? So, right. I can't speak for anybody else, but I knew right. that it was a certain shit I'd be, like, thinking to myself, like, yo, man, I'm getting the fuck off this shit, because mm. I ain't feeling this. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because... I don't like that. You know what I mean? Like, I grew up with my man, my partner, Five, and we grew up on some real protective shit over each other, mm. and we never be willing to, like, fight each other or, you know what I'm saying? We be just straight, you know what I'm saying? Oh, salute, my salute, nigga. Salute, my brother. And, man, you, for your, for your first, you gotta, you gotta sit when you salute. Oh, all right, my fault. <laughs> the first record you came out with was Neo, was with Neo, right? The first per- time in the world seen you. That's not my first record. Nah, nah, like, the first time in the world seen you. Nah, though. Flipside was pretty big. Yeah. Flipside yeah. was before that? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I thought the Neo record was before that. Nah. Oh, Flipside okay. was like an 05. But you got way you more pussy over there. You got way more pussy over the Neo record, though. Yeah, the Let's Neo, keep it real. The, the Neo, Neo record. Yeah, That's when you got some pussy, yeah. goddammit. Come on. Come on, goddamn. You was out there knocking him down. Come on, man. Come on, goddamn. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Niggas got blood. Niggas start blushing uh, and shit like that. No. Come on, <laughs> Come on man. No. You know. No, but the flip side record was really big. That you got me called, but I didn't yeah. know. <laughs> that the new flip- artist supposed to be something different. Come on. When you're new and you're a new artist, come on. You know I know, baby. All right. So but a new artist is like <laughs> mad different times. I'm but a new <laughs> artist is CNN, a new I'm artist is Nori, and a new artist is Reggaeton. Nigga, no I doubt. did it. You I know what I mean? Come no on, nigga, hit that. I ain't hitting that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, so what's, what's fucking your, A, man? That should be fucking What's your real, favorite man. part of the game? I say that again. What's your favorite part of the game? Of the game? Mm hmm. Honestly, man, at first, at first, I really didn't care about the bread situation. You know what I mean? Mm. I just was really happy to, to to make it to a point to where, as though, you know, I was really into my craft. I was one of them rappers. Mm. I was one of the rappers that was really into his pen, real like a real hip hop head rapper. Mm. I wasn't like a drug, a little young drug nigga that started rapping. And you know mm. what I mean? Just, mm. It go that way sometimes. Yeah. Nigga be a really trap nigga and shit, and then he mm. start putting little rhymes together and shit. Mm-hmm. See, Beans never really rapped back in the day. Beans was a hustler, mm. a street little street nigga. Mm-hmm. But uh, he just started fucking around. I think his man rap, I believe his man rap right. real good. His man make it, put him on the little dope shit, right. and he started rhyming. Me, I just been rhyming right. first. You know what I'm saying? So right. I always been hip hopped out. So for to, to get to a point that I be able to uh, express my shit to the world and motherfuckers know my shit right. that was the most fulfilling shit to like run up on somebody and he know my whole verse like mm. over yeah. money one time Black Thought spit my verse to me and Black Thought always been a rap guy yes, in yes. the world he still is but one day I had a show and I was getting out the car about to go into the show and in the parking lot he was dolo he was walking he's yeah, he walking like, he like Andre D. Thousand type I look, walking around by himself yo I looked at him I'm like oh what the fuck are you doing down here I'm like, I know, I didn't think he was going to my shit. He's like, y'all came to see you, man. Wow. I'm like, oh shit. He's like, yo, crack, know what my shit was? And he spit a verse uh, to a, a freestyle and he knew every word and shit like that. That was it at first. But now, though, wow, you know, that shit kind of weird where you be like, all right, I'm over it. You get jaded. But, but you ever, you ever, because anybody could look at you and be like, you know, you're, you're a star. Like, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate it. Like, you, you're, you're, you're a star. So, like is is it any move that you felt like you made wrong that 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 made you not be that that guy? You know what I'm trying to yeah, say? You know to, what I mean? To the to the the full potential that right, we right, really exactly, expect. You know exactly, what I'm saying? Exactly. Right. Um, I could think of a few things, a lot of things. To be honest with you, you know what I mean? Okay. I think I was I think I was overwhelmed. You know what I'm saying? I was overwhelmed with money and uh, 
just uh, feeding into a certain mm. type of, uh, uh, what you call it, like culture. Because around yeah. the time that we got on, they gave us too much money at that age. And mm. that's around the time that drinking syrup was out, smoking wet, mm. and uh, just... Uh, just getting real fucked up. It was a real get fucked up era. You know what I'm saying? I lived in it. You lived in it, yeah. Uh-huh. Yes. So it's like crazy because it's like I tell niggas that I used to do shit almost ten more ten times more than the average nigga. You know what I'm mm. saying? Because I get treated. We, we, afford have, it. we have more money, and even with the money, we go somewhere and everything was free. You know what I'm saying? I had to spend the money. Yes, goddamn it. Yes, goddamn it. No, I'm saying. Yes, I, mean, I do. See, like, yes, he, I do. He know what I'm talking yes, about. That's the good yes, side of shit. No, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, that was at the time. Yeah, it was yeah. pretty good. Nah, it's especially it was good. fun for y'all, but but in retrospect, it nah, wasn't but, that good. Okay, so honestly, though, I think I think that had a lot to do with it, man. Just being overwhelmed with everything that was going on. Nobody really knew exactly what to do. Everybody right. act like they knew though. All right. Like freeway and everybody, I'm like, yo, y'all niggas are confident and comfortable as hell. I'm like uh, lost out this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? They so, always say you don't stop playing because um, you get old. You get old because you stop playing. So I choose. Oh, to, run that back. They say you don't get old because you stop playing. No, no, you you don't stop playing because you, you don't get stop old. playing because you get old. You get old because you stop playing. That make a lot of sense. You know what I'm saying? So Real like, shit. But you it, always. It, it, what does it mean to stop playing? You, uh, what it means is you always got to act Stay like it's active. the new, the new. Like when the first time you ever DJ, you ever knew when the crowd go crazy, you got to always remember that moment. Of you course, know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's the thing is. Yeah. You know no, what I mean? can um, relate to that. You can always yeah. seek yeah. that inspiration. Like, I, like it's so fucked up. It's like crazy because I can never, ever, 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 ever be like happy if I hear my song on the on the radio because I had. So many of them, right. like so. I, I don't yeah. get me wrong. Like if I have Do one now, I'll be, like, I'll be like, oh, but I'll be like, ah, right. fuck it. I had that shit for ten years. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And so, you don't mean to seem unappreciative, because I, I am. Yeah. I am appreciative, but no it's doubt. just sometimes you just grow out of that. Real shit. You know my call my phone about, yo, turn the radio on. You on the radio? Right. Oh, right, y'all mean to sound like a dick, but I've been right. on the radio for like twenty years. Right, 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 right. Right. It's not the same no more. It's not. Nah, the same. It's not, man. So you coming from Philly? And you know, uh, one of the dudes that's in the headlines right now is Little Uzi Vert. And uh, <coughs> I like I like Little Uzi, man. It took me a little second to grasp it, but when he first came out, he came out with like some. It was some weird shit to me, kind of. I, it was the more youngest shit, you know what I'm saying? But then uh, closer to now, he be spitting some shit now, like his freestyles and shit. He kind of got me. Hey, babe, don't I fuck with him? Mm. I fucks with Uzi now. Mm. I fuck with him anyway because he was from Philly, but I wasn't listening. Right. I'm listening now. Like so I don't look like the average Philly guy. He don't, yo. North Philly at that. Oh, he, oh, he from he from, from my side. Lands. He from Bad Yeah, lands? he from the lands. Oh, okay. God damn it. Borderline lands, but Borderline close lines. to the lands. Adjacent. Lands adjacent. All right. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's all good. So but I'm talking about, I wasn't even talking about that. I'm talking about like the different type of style. How did it, how, like, 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 because it's not the average. Yeah, so, so yeah, that's a great, that's a great, great right. way to twist it. Right. So you think that, because I don't think an artist could have came out with purple hair, with turquoise, you know, lavender skin mm. um, when you guys. All turquoise, lavender skin? I, yeah. <laughs> they got all of that going on now. I mean, you know what I mean. Yeah, like, you can make your skin like, like, bad colors. Yeah. Hey, man. Hey, that's hey, the man, next man, move. Just, just ride with me, man. It's, it's the last right. dragon, oh. man. <laughs> <laughs> the last dragon type shit. That's the next but, move, though. But um, you know, um, I'm done with that one, man. I ain't gonna lie. That shit is fucking me up. I'm done with that See, one. See, look, you trying to put me on. I'm done. I'm smoking. I'm smoking. I'm smoking regular Sean Blunt. But, um, Where the book is at? Uh, what the fuck I was saying? Damn. Purple lavender skin yeah. with fish skin. No, uh, what was what was saying? <laughs> about, it's about the, about the music. You're about the music gonna look. He want fuck. No, me. did you think? Did you think? Did you think like like uh, Philly would produce somebody like that? Because this is like y'all. Yeah, first, like, you never, know. Never. No, I never would have thought that. I would, but to be honest with you, I never would have thought that hip-hop would produce anything like mm-hmm. that. But that goes to show you that it, it's going to take its course where it's going to go. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I don't ever trip about that. But like, was I it like, hip-hop? Uh, so, so you let I your, think the question is, was it hip-hop that produced So that? your son come out no, the room not. and he's dressed like little Uzi Vert. What happens? I mean, I definitely would break down to him that to make sure that this is what he want to do. All right. That's basically that's almost like you got just, the nose rings. Yeah, all of that cuz you can't stop on what they rings want. On one they can't be you or where you from. I right. can't expect nobody to understand. If you wasn't there, I'd be like, "Yo, I understand that you don't say." Like, look, it'll be a song I think is whack, right? A new song that's hot right. to them. And they'd be like, "Yo, check this out." My my right. son would do some shit like that. Right. He'd be like, "Yo, dad, this shit hot." Uh, 
Nah, man, no. Nah. Oh, look, the mama, that's my yeah. shit, though. When I first heard that shit, nah, I said, like, yo, my nigga. Exactly. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Oh, man. Oh, man. When I first heard that, I said, what are these niggas doing? This is this is college chants. I like that's it. That's chants. Like, uh, and then, uh, then I heard it in the club. I said, my old ass needs to relax. This is it. You were nervous. This is it. I was like, oh, my oh, God. Wait, wait, wait. Because you like something or something is dope, does it mean automatically it's dope hip-hop? I don't know what that trick question you hit niggas with right question. now. <laughs> I don't know question. what the fuck was that. It's not a trick question, That though. nigga asked us the same thing twice. No, He's not fall for that one. No, I'm, I'm not fucking with him because he keep bringing this hip-hop shit up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Look, we understand that we not getting hip-hop right now. All right. Okay. All right, we getting That's industry music. You know what right. I'm saying? Okay. So I'm not holding that So you that understand them. everything I'm saying? I'm not being harsh on them. They not, they'll tell you that they this ain't hip-hop. They're like, yo, we just we doing with our new shit. Right. That so, nigga little baby said, I wish I would. I maybe would it. <laughs> I said that's hard. Yeah, that's I'll not trying. That's because I'll be too hard on them though when it's yeah. something they wanna do. You know yeah, what I'm saying? I, 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 I'm no, not, there's no reason to be hard on them. I'm just saying. But you throw throwing the hip hop card out there a lot. No, no, right no, now. No. Yeah, because you gotta describe it, you gotta understand it. All right. All right, but if they was presenting it as if it was hip hop, it's rap. They're rapping. Right. Difference, you know well, what I'm saying? Sometimes they ain't rapping. No, sometimes they're not. Sometimes. Sometimes, they, but they, sometimes it's like more R&B. Meg Thee Stallion got true, ball. True that, so let's just that. keep it 100. Oh, you right. I didn't know y'all you know. talking about the singing shit. Yeah. Right. Yeah, right. singing yeah. shit is, is, is kind of... Yeah. But Meg Thee Stallion got bars. That chick, stripper rap? She do. Straps? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, she do got the bars. Straps. That's what they call it. No, no, I don't know. Stripper rap. Tell me some. Tell me some of those lyrics. Oh, I don't know no lyrics. I don't even know some of my shit. Nigga, so, you know. But make a stallion spin. Yeah, I ain't fucking with it. Uh, what's that nigga? Young CEO. Sure. What's that? That's baby. Oh, the baby. It's this little baby and it's the baby. He's spitting. That's, but both of them spit too. The little that, baby spit that shit too. No, but he he sing along. He like, y'all do the show? Yeah, but he could get into it. No. No, but he get into it too. I got this shit in my dick. He get into the rough stuff. Hey, true. Hey, if I, he said, I, he said, I did the undiggable. I wish I would. I don't know what he talking about. I don't know what he yeah. talking about. I'm sorry. Not. I'm fucking with Denzel Curry, young motherfucker from Miami. <laughs> yes. He's spitting. The yes. reason, the reason from from TD, he's spitting. Mm. Young cats is spitting too, like straight up hip hop lyrics. I'm not gonna lie, EFN. Yeah. I ain't. You are just very true. But lately, I've been on some dumb ignorant shit. And I don't be wanting to hear lyrics. I be wanting to hear what these young niggas be wanting no, to hear. I want to hear what my son walk, playing by when I walk by his room. Yo, I like, been on some goofy like, shit too. Like there's, there's a nigga in New York mind. named Pop Smoke. He's hard. And you heard him because of your son? I heard him because... I know, I know. I heard him because some promotional dude was playing it. Huh? You heard him in the club. Huh? And then I heard him in the club and it was over. I was like, oh, it's the new Bobby Smurda. He's kind of hard. He's kind of hard. But let me ask you this. No disrespect to anybody here. Yes. But is it maybe that maybe we not supposed to understand that shit? Yeah, I know. Yeah, but we washed up. Yes, it's a fact. <laughs> no, no, yes, not washed up. Yeah, not I mean, you up. know what I mean, according to them. Like, you, you know, know no like, like, I kid you not. When no your bogeys, daughter turns no 10 years old, you're going to be so mad at what she's listening to. Like, you know. No, she'll oh, be a baby for life. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah but, but you know what I'm trying to say. Like, no, I know. I you're going to be so shocked because it's going to be the exact opposite of what you... I, I I can't say that because you, you don't know, right? She, like she might grow up and then it might go right back to a fucking law nah, professor. My, my days. daughter's gonna be a turntable. You, you know what I'm saying? So so <laughs> so definitely. So um, but uh, what's up with the bogey love? No no cigarettes, no cigarettes. No, you right said now. earlier. You said I, I'm come just on. lowering you in. I'm not smoking. Yeah, he lied I'm not smoking this <laughs> shit. Right smoke, here. come on, my brother. Come on. Oh. Your fans want to see you smoke, Hell, man. No, I'm not smoking they want to see you smoke. And you got a lot of tattoos as well. Your tattoos match your shirt. <laughs> I want a I know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I got this shirt. <laughs> you look like you got a sleeve. It's like it's look like I knew they would go to death. It's a sleeve. Like what you drinking over there? Colombian wine. You want some? No. Oh, you, you said, said you're taking shots. <laughs> oh, is it wine you said? No, Definitely that's, not wine. That's not wine. <laughs> I wouldn't get that. That's well, what, I mean, coke, that's what, that's what the people in Colombia, coke, that's cocaine. After they hit the cocaine, <laughs> they nah, take bomb. Cocaine. They, 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 they take a line. You want something to take a shot? I'm definitely not drinking that. I'll take some Tiger Bone. Where the shot glasses at? Shot glasses at? Mr. Lee. We're going to loosen you up, Pete Crack. Because you know what? We celebrate people's career. And you know what? We celebrating you today. You know what? We celebrating you today. You know what? You know what? We celebrating you today. You know what? Fuck up, man. Come on, go get take a yeah, shot, goddammit. Gotta take a shot, and I gotta take a piss, but I'ma hold it down. So, who pouring this? Look, who pouring? Yo, hey, 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 hey
Big up to uh, 2020 Smoke Miami. Champs, yes, sir. Yo, don't Smoke forget, we're now streaming on Title. Episodes will be released exclusively on Title. Ooh, God so damn make it. Make sure to download. God damn it. Title.com. God damn it. Drink Champs off. God damn it. I'm taking yeah. a shot. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, P. Crack, we don't know if you know. Shout out Massive Pill. Shout out Revolt TV. You don't know if you know, but we have a show. Hold on, y'all. It's called Drink Champs. Oh, that's, what's that? What's that? That white shit. Oh, that's a white shit. I'm not. I'm not in. I'm not in. I gotta wait. Yo, give me the tiger. <laughs> oh, you, oh, we doing it together? Let's do it, brother. Yeah, let me see. Let me see. Hold on. He gave me a little baby. Oh, so let me see. Let me fuck with it. Out. Nah, nah. You gotta give him a little bit more. Oh, yeah, Come on. Tiger bone and aqua. Pour up. Nah, man. What are you doing? Tiger bone and aqua. Where's that? Pass is that right there? Yeah, yeah. Come on. That's cool. Damn. 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 All right. Damn. No, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Pass the bottle, though. Let me right. go back. Go back. Go back. Oh, you say I represent. <laughs> All right, Pete Cracks with a shot of Tiger Bone and Agua Guinea. Look, you gotta do What's that Pete crap. Listen, man. <laughs> I do want some Tiger Bone, though. All right, listen. It's only right. right. You know what I'm saying? All right, listen. Pete Crack, you are family. No doubt. We, 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 we recently blew up. We want you to know that our platform is your platform. No Anytime doubt. you want to come here and you want to promote anything. You want to talk about anything? You want to? Talk, it's, we are here no for doubt. you. Salud, man. Salud, brother. I God damn it. it. Cheers. Oh, ah. That was. That was. Oh, that was nice. That, that tastes was, like Zambuca, <laughs> man. I don't know what that means, but yeah, let's coffee do it. and liquor, right? Zambuca. No, coffee Zambuca and is, is a liquor like that. White. It's an agua diente. It tastes like black jelly beans, right? It, exactly. Yeah, licorice. Yep. Licorice. Yeah. Well, this shit tastes like spoiled cat ass. No, nah, <laughs> the Moet. No, the, uh, no, 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 the Tiger Bowl. Hey, tiger we, do that, we, we might turn into that shit too. So, so what's good? Philly, Philly, you got, you guys got. Oh my God. You guys got. Ooh. Uh, got Will Smith. Mm-hmm. Then you guys formed this state property thing. It it doesn't work out at some point. All right. Now it's time for P Crack. To go on his own. What, what, what label did you sign to? Was it Land Speed or something like that? No, that ain't the way it went though. No. <laughs> <laughs> Why you like this Land Speed like that? No, I didn't. I, didn't I never even that. heard of them. <laughs> uh, I did. I, I had a deal with Land Speed. It was like, American Digital <laughs> or something. But like that? is that a that's a thing though? Yeah, Land no, Speed. No, no, yeah, Land Speed was out of Boston. That's like the first American Digital. Fifty million. No, no, but I never signed with them. They was they was false promoting. American Digital. Yeah. Okay. We point though. We was in the midst about to do something with them, but then they did some fuck shit, and then after that, it was just like fuck it. We ain't doing. It. But mm. that ain't the way it went. Okay, it went please break it down. When we, when they, when everything separated. When you uh, say separated, you talking about the Rock. Yeah. Because you were signed to the Rock. Right, we signed to the Rock. You were signed to the Rock with me. A little bit. I didn't sign a contract, but go ahead. Yeah. You was there. Though. I was there. He falsified papers. Yes, I did. <laughs> I was scared to sign the paperwork. And they scared to sign the paperwork. It, it seemed like it, that too. It worked out for me. Go ahead. <laughs> he still got the chain though. Yeah. I don't know where it is, man. Oh, uh, you don't know where it is? Oh, I, I it think y'all really got it. Y'all got it. Look at that. Look at that. Oh no, but getting back to what you were saying about the Neo record, that's how the Neo record came about. I like about. how you switched it all the way back. I, no, because that's, that. where, that's where it no, goes. Nigga, I respect that. No, that's where it goes. How From, did you get the call? OG Wan? I feel like OG Wan called. Was it? Nah. Tata? Tata? It was Tata, yeah. Tata, see, yeah, I, yeah. I, I know, I know yeah, what happened. Sorry, yeah. So where you at? You get the call, go ahead. We got the call. Well, it wasn't even a call. I was in a meeting with mm. Jay, and then uh, Tata had slid his hand, like, had, excuse me, looked in the office. Yeah. And was just like, yo, crack, I need to holler at you. I got this artist. And let's be clear, Neo's nobody at the time. No one ever heard of him. His name is NN, Neo nobody. But he was doing some shit, though. He was writing mad shit, but we didn't know. You know what I'm saying? So I got this artist, man, about to drop this album. This nigga, hot. I need a verse right now. Mm. So I'm like, all right, cool. This back on the CD days. Mm. We had CDs. Mm. I'm like, bet, just print me the CD up. I think I talked about this shit on the last show. Well, right, mm-hmm. No, I never said this yet. Them no. niggas don't remember you. Let's oh, go. All right, so that's, let's go. Let's, let's, go let's, 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 let's get some new shit. They, this dude the day, I was like, yo, give me the CD. He's like, no, nah, I ain't no CD. I need to do it right now. Like, mm. he's like, yo, do it now. We about to And we got that baseline? We, oh. was, we was in that big building that the Def Jam was in. Oh, Def Jam. No, but that building, that wasn't their whole building. Def Jam? That wasn't their building. Um, Universal. Universal, yeah. yeah come on, Street. 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 Like a the park. parking lot to the left. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so we in there. So we walked. It was winter time. We just walked right out to fucking, um, let's take a little hit with you, bro. Go ahead. See, I walked out that. We went to the stool. Mm-hmm. They threw on one track. Uh, Ty threw on, oh, Guru was there too. Guru was waiting. It was just right. me and my manager at the time. Right. And Guru, I like this too. It's just smooth. It's very smooth. It's, it's called that OG Diego. I was Diego. wondering what it was going to look like. Yeah. He uh, threw on one track. I ain't like that. It was cool. It was all right. But the uh-huh. second one, 
was the was the stay with me joint, the Neo joint. Stay so with me. me, they left me and Guru there, and we knocked it out. And I didn't think nothing of it. I didn't think that. Your first go, Kaleen, did ma? Oh, Kaleen, did ma? Kaleen, did ma? You're like a lean, babe, ma. You're like a lean, babe, ma. I say Kaleen, did. You're like a lean, babe. That's just, you know, we took it back to. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Uh huh. So, did the song. Got the check, because uh, Dev done cut the check quick. 15 bands. It sounds like 15 bands check. in my mind. It was 11. I'm going to be real. Okay, all right. Cool. Good. <laughs> I was only all four. I was only all four. It was okay. 11, okay. But, okay. but the percentages were straight on the end and everything. It was a good, it was great. Right. So anyway, uh, we ain't thinking nothing of it. We was in Miami. We was here for like a long ass time, for like mm-hmm. like two months, working on mm-hmm. some other shit. Mm-hmm. And uh, the whole time we was here, the, number, the song was rising in uh, New York. Mm. On Hot 97, it was going up, so it, it turned number one mm. in New York on the radio. So that's when uh, they was like, oh, we shooting a video. And after mm. the video got shot, the shit just shot up. The album went like four times platinum or some shit like that. And it, that was, that's the now, biggest song I did. Now, I did a, day. a record with Maya on the Belly soundtrack, right? And like I was like the hot dude. And then Maya, I did, and, and Raekwon was on the record too. So when it came time to put a video... Raekwon didn't show up, and Raekwon requested for them to pay him. Pay him. Mm. Like so, an invoice? Yeah, he for said, the pay, video? pay me for the video. Mm. Not so, showing up. I had, ne- I had never knew you could do that. What? So Ray, Ray, they, they somehow found the check for this nigga. This nigga popped up. I'm here on, with a suit on. I'm being like a team player. Right, yeah. And I'm like, oh, okay. I'm like, yo, boy, my Ray, like, yo, you ain't get a check? I'm like, nah, right? So I'm like, all right, cool. I said, yo, I'm going to take this one. And I, I stood there, and I repped for Maya. Then two years later... Mm-hmm. I called Maya's people. Her, uh, the dude name was Hak Islam. Hak Islam or Hak. That's her management? That was her management at the time. The same dude who called me to get and thanked me for, you know, not charging them for the right. video. Two years later, they was like, we can't have Maya running around with gangsters. Uh. And fronted on me. After, like, I was a part of, like... And you took that the, little hit, I, I took the hit yeah. and all that. Like, did, have you ever experienced that with like a, a, a Neo or somebody like that? Somebody um, like you? Because you, nah. whether you look at it like that or not, you helped him, you know? No, dog. You know I don't be looking at it like that, though. I, I mean, like you we helped each other a lot, you okay. know what I'm saying? Because people are like, yo, you, yo, if it wasn't for you, oh, I can't say that. After that one song, this nigga had a million fucking hits right. that. It wasn't like that was his right. one But still, joint. but still, but still. If that's yeah, it, no doubt. you ain't say go. Ain't no Start. telling what his, the, the yeah. intro would have been. You know what yeah. I mean? The yeah. boost, the yeah. boost was there. It's just like I told Nas the other day. It's like, um, he feels like, yeah, I would have been who I am without I'm leaving. But reality of it is, I'm leaving is what made me as a solo artist. You know yeah, what I'm saying? On, on the firm album. That's a fact. Uh, I was such no, a Nori fan, facts. man. I, I was brought anyway. Like, before that oh, shit. Good looking, so but you, 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 you yeah, I agree either that I don't think I'm leaving was what made No, me. I'm, I'm just telling you. I, I, it doesn't matter yeah, what you nah, agree you with or not. I'm telling you as a person who lived it, a per, that I needed something to push me over. People right. did not believe in me right. as... CNN, Capone, and Noriega. I actually. Do you I mean, think it was the record or the people involved in the record? No, it was. It was. I, they. It was my hunger. That's why Nas kept saying it was his hunger because that style. They everyone thought that was like a, a so new style. It's the record. It's the record. Right. Um, I can't. I can't tell you. I'm just saying. In, in general, it was that record that was the was was the camel on. What is that shit? The hay. Um, was destroyed it? Camel the destroyer. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. That shit all <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> No, what at do you want to call it? At least you know, the camera yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, so, fucking so, everything. So it's the same, <laughs> but it's the same shit, though. It's like, um, regardless of what Neo can say, and that, you know, that's my guy. I was just playing yeah, when no I said doubt. nobody Neo. But um, that was then, because that was then. But he became, from, from nobody Neo then, and he just became that dude. He became mm, yeah, everybody yo. Neo. Hey, was you able to get him back on the record? Oh, yeah, you lie. <laughs> what? I'm, what? I'm doing that's that's a legitimate question. That's a legitimate question. What are you talking about? I've never attempted to uh, get him back on the record. Oh, nigga. To be nigga. Honest, nigga. Nigga. Look, this is the thing. At the time when I did that joint, uh, I I probably could have used it, but I didn't feel as though I, that wasn't the route. Like I still was doing so much other shit at the time. Mm. So now I feel like, yo, why attempt... At, at a point after that, unless it's something big, you know what I'm saying? Right. Unless it's something big. If the wave, if it's not waving still, and nah. you got to create it, you never want a nigga to seem like he throwing you an ollie you. Nah, you know what? You know what? Because that I, don't look good. I, 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 you know what I think me and you both suffer from? We both suffer from the same shit. 
we don't want to make a commercial record because we think it's not it. But the thing is, if that's your route, I'm gonna be honest. I don't with agree you. with you. I don't I'm mind be honest commercial with you. records. I think it's just make I, a good record. I, I think I Capone's never... whole career should have been Ja Rule's. Like Who? I don't I, know why I, he would like, think like, I he, feel that way. I like commercial records. No, I'm saying because why wouldn't you? That, why wouldn't that be a go to? Like as soon as you see Neo, maybe like, because I thought maybe because he got so big, I didn't want to utilize it unless I thought it was the move. But it never was like like I ain't doing no shit with no R and B shit. That was the that's always been like an option for me mm. if it's if I feel strong about it. You know what I'm saying? I'm mm. willing to push heavy with it. Mm. That's why I'm straight. Okay, and I I ain't, I ain't gonna use that. Why utilize no, that? And you're right. not ready. Mm. But it wasn't. Don't think it was because I'm uh, straying away from the. Uh, I thought. The I, I thought because you know I used to do that. I used no. to do that. I used to be a little nervous about. No, I like them jiggy ass records. Mm. I'm on Kayleen Day mind. Right, so what right. the fuck? I did that shit right. for having fun on that. Right. It wasn't uncomfortable for me. You know what I mean? Right. Right. Yeah. Most of a lot of my records that's like the records is mostly known for me is the up tempo drinks. Like got <sighs> to have it. Right. Never got to have it uh-huh. on the flip side. Uh-huh. That shit, that's not like, that shit, it's street, but it's not like some hard gangster shit. All that right. shit, all club jiggy jinks. And, and, and you realize flip side um, has no age. Like you can put yeah. that shit on in the, the club, club right, right now. now. Yeah. Yeah. That shit feels like it's brand I tell, motherfucking I tell my people, I'm like, yo, it's flip side playing somewhere right now yeah. every day right. in a bar or club somewhere. Right. <laughs> yo. Yeah. 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 I'm talking about forever. You like, know, there's yeah. people that won't ever have one hit record. Word. There's people that you know won't. Uh, there's people right now who have great careers who won't have one hit record. Word. Still, like I look at a couple of these underground artists, and they're making money, but they won't have. They don't have that radio. They don't have that smash right. that one thing. Like, that will remember like, forever. Like, yeah, like a person don't have to know me, or know who I am, or nothing. But I, 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 but you I, I there, actually though. happened. I actually this actually happened to me one time. <laughs> Dude bumped into me. I bumped into him. I, I come. I, I'm sorry. And then homeboy come on. He's ice grilling me. Homeboy. I came to party. Shit. And, I, and I'm looking at this nigga like you fucking bumped. You, you a fullerino? Like you, 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 you're there. Yeah, that guy be crazy. But you know what I'm no, saying. That like, but that's crazy. real shit. Like sometimes yeah. you know the, your, your records will outgrow you. That's crazy. You know though. what I'm saying for yeah. real. Could you imagine somebody grilling you to your right. own shit? I mean, genuinely yeah. grilling you. Genuinely. Not even trying to do it because right. you, you, because right. like you just some nigga to him. Right. He's like barking to your own shit. He, though. He's flipping on me with my vocals. That's fucked up. And I looked at it him. Make I you like, think, it almost made me say, say no. I kind of like you, nigga. Right, right. right. You, you, like, you like it. Don't yeah, yeah, lie, you like it. Yeah, yeah. Relax. <laughs> no, no, you, you yeah, don't yeah. like the nigga because you know that yeah. where it's coming from. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You respect yeah. the joint. Like, yeah. yo, I'm glad you like the joint, but right. you still like on some. That was some well, suspect shit. Where's one of the most crazy. Let's talk about one shot now. Come on, let's go, Mr. Lee. What's one of the most craziest places, like you know, people showed you love that you you didn't you didn't think you would in you Russia? Would. Get out of here, in Russia! Really, we didn't have love. We didn't have love. Yeah, we didn't have no love in Russia. No, I did two shows in Russia, and I couldn't even talk to nobody. Nobody. Right. Nobody language, speak right, English. Language wise, yeah. yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, you gotta right. be specific. <laughs> yeah, yo, let them know what you talk about. Right, right. Yo, I can't. I ain't know. No, they don't speak. They don't right. speak no English. But they spoke Yo, but when music. the show Flipside came on, everybody knew the whole song. Yeah. Flipside? Oh. It fucked me up. Everybody knew the whole song. You remember what part of Russia you were in? Uh, one of them was Peter something, St. Peter's. St. Peter's. Peter's, Peter's, Peter's. That's Peter's where we went. That's yeah, Peter's Burn. Right, yeah. That one and then the other one. They was close to each other though. Moscow, probably. Yeah, Peter's Burn um, and Moscow. Yeah, but right. it was dope out there. I had fun and you went with there. state property or you went no, by yourself? I went yourself? dolo. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah I'm fucking like with it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go, Peter. We went solo. Pete Crack, I'm what not up? gonna lie, man. You one of the dopest dudes, man. Um, well, thank you, I think you need to, you know, continue working because it, I, I feel like I feel like you still have a, a lot left in, in your pulse. Okay, no doubt. I feel and you. um, I don't want you to give up that shot. I want you to maintain because no doubt. if people know what I know about you, and and the world should know already, but. You're one of the dopest artists, and no you're doubt. one of the most creative artists I ever seen. Thank you. And you get busy in that studio. I've been in the studio with you. Salud, salud, salud. salud. and Cover this is songs. also for you. Salud, salud, brother. Mm. Hate it. <laughs> Hated it. <laughs> ah. Oh. So, it. Ah. so at some point, at some harsh. point, <laughs> it's harsh. Damn, it's harsh. Oh, at some point, the whole Philly is changing. That's like the rap scene. Uh, it's different. That was harsh, though. No. State, yeah, no problem. State property. That's the shit you clean your plumbing with. 
State property is is, is breaking up. They're we breaking hearing, up. No, bro, they they never broke up though. But you know what I'm saying. You you hearing like discrepancies, yeah, discrepancies. of beans and all this thing. That's gonna happen. Then is this kid? They got another tour coming up, man. Is this kid? Hold on, before this. Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Is this kid that come out of nowhere? Well, to us, it was from nowhere. Mm -hmm. And his name is Meek Mill. Right. And at the time, Meek Mill, he comes, whatever. But by the time Meek drops, I'm a boss. Right. The comparisons to you is undeniable. No doubt. Like, meaning everyone is saying that. Mm -hmm. Like the flow? Yeah, because... Your flow is something that we. Like, you know, I never thought of that, but now that you say that, this is true. He knows. No, 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 no. I never but thought honestly, of it, but now I, I see. Honestly, it. Uh -huh. I never thought it. I never, I never think. But that, you heard it from the streets. But that's what I hear a lot. You know what I'm saying? And I know where. I know why though. From a from a naked ear. You know what I'm saying? From an ear that hasn't been there and don't understand the details of it. It would sound like that, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But from my perspective, I just I see I see influence, you know what I'm saying? I'm That's what I see. I see influence. Which is hip hop by itself. But check it, look, when when we came up uh and I came in 2005, uh me, I don't know how old me, me probably was like like 12 or 13 years old. Mm -hmm. That's what you call inf he's influenced by mm -hmm. whether it was me, he might not have been a couple of Subconsciously, he don't even know. He's influenced because that's how we come right. up. That's how you come, that's how you get your style. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And uh see if it was a nigga my age, you'd be like, yo, that nigga biting. Right. Because right. you can't be at the same age. No, that's you know real, what I'm saying? That's real. Yeah, that's, that's, that's real. The whole nigga girl. can't be influenced, nigga. You right. biting there. Right. You know what right. I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> right. That's the first time. Hey, you know, Okay. Yeah. But he was young, so I kind of take it like a pat on the back. You know what I'm saying? We all from Philly. Right. And to hear him, when they say that, you know what I'm saying? I'm right. like, bet, bet. I was in, I'm influential to niggas. I had a lot of, I had my shit in a lot of niggas. Did y'all ever cross path? Like, cross path yeah, in, in done a bad a lot way of, or in a good way? Y'all done records no. together? We got like eight records together. Yeah, right. well, you know what I'm saying? We right. all from Philly, so niggas used right. to work with each other heavy. Right. But would you say cross paths like, like, in a like, bad way? Like, like in a good way, like what I mean, like you no, know what I'm saying? Was, since that happened, because because you never put that rumor out. That's what I'm saying. Like you right. never You say never, since the rumor happened? Since the, that, there, was, there was a that heavy wasn't really rumor. a rumor no, though. Why would rumor. that be it was, a rumor is like a negative bad thing. They're like, yo, that's a rumor. Right. Okay, okay, that's you're right. just a it was it was And why is that even negative? Like that shouldn't even be negative. I didn't feel like that. I appreciate you, man, because this nigga right here. No, I'm not actually shit. No, I'm actually not. I'm actually not. I'm not gonna No, because what I'm saying is I couldn't, I couldn't compare for to be. Um, uh, I couldn't stop being compared to Mob Deep. I couldn't stop. I've that. never heard that, but that's because your ear wasn't really to the streets. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, with you, I, I never heard, heard that you either. in the streets. Well, I'm talking about Capone and Noriega when as we as came as out. Never. Yes, yes, yes that's, you that's what you the fuck we was compared to. Like yeah. Listen, at never look, heard at, that look at all our reviews in the that. sauce. Yeah. Look at all our reviews. That's the only thing they compared us to. But you know that was wrong. I know they was wrong, but that's the thing in the articles. We talking about the world. The articles still exist. The, the right, article right. still a bit. Right. So listen, I didn't feel like that. This is what I'm trying to say. I didn't feel like uh, I sound like Mob Deep, but, but those articles still existed. Oh, and articles? Of, of, yeah. All right, yeah but and, and but you saying. know what, though? You got to look at it from their perspective. They, the, if you reading this shit, them niggas not from down the way, from right. the hood. Right. These some niggas that's just uh, going off of image and shit. And y'all both from Queens. Right. Uh, y'all both from the hood graphics, image. Right. They yeah. didn't yeah. pay attention to If you see the type of personalities and characters, like... Capone right. and Nori is they totally right. two different motherfuckers from, from half I and, and P. I, I agree with you. You wouldn't say that. I agree with you. Know you. So I that's from you. some shit like all right, Queens stereotypical shit. Uh, yeah. Queens, uh, yeah, two. But it's the same thing with the stereotypical with Philly. This is what I'm trying to say to you. Like it's the same exact thing. It's the same exact thing because. Um, it's the flow. People are saying yeah, that's no PD crack flow, and you know I'm not I, making up this. Yeah, room, I, huh? look, I ain't got no problem with it. All right. Keep on influencing. I hope, and he and he went to influence millions of um, yes, young he is. he is the man. So, he is actually so, my favorite so, new artist. But at this, so and me, I, I like I like what he's doing right now. You yeah, know what I'm saying? I, right I now, he it. he's grown into a, a nice pocket. You know what yes, I'm saying? Yes, I agree. But to me, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's a Philly thing anyway. I, me coming up, I'll be taking the credit right now, but. 
Before me, it was motherfuckers that I got that from, because that was just mm. a thing, that type of vibe in Philly. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of niggas that rap, I'd be telling my folks, I know a lot of niggas that I came up rapping with that I knew, that I knew was better than me, mm. right? But didn't get the opportunity. And mm. I never seen them, and they never made it. And I was like, mm. damn. And I know in my heart, when I was a kid, that they was, I used to go home at the hand them and go got a right, like, yo, this nigga was the illest. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Never made it. So mm. it's, you know what I'm saying? It's a but that, that, thing. that could be a, like you said, it's a lineage of Philly. Mm. Yeah, it's true. Because I never thought of that, and now that you said that, I, no. hear, the, I hear the cadence. Yeah, in the flow. I, I hear it too, but I, but I agree with with crack. I don't think that he was biting. No, I think he was no. influenced. No, it's, it's I, a lineage, I like and I think it's that's like, the, it's, like, it's paying like, homage in a sense without even knowing it. Like when I told Nas, I said, "Yo, listen, if it wasn't for Illmatic, I wouldn't be rhyming like right. this." That's the truth. It changed my whole rhyme cadence because when I seen, I said, "What this nigga said? That buff that bumped the bottle could have struck the lotto." Yeah, I said, "Holy moly, guacamole! I gotta yeah. change my shit." Yeah, that you was his too. At you the know what I'm saying? I gotta yeah. change my shit, so I changed my whole shit. So it's the same thing. And so just so people know that it was listening or just tuning in, like I believe that that is like dope. Like I believe that that's dope. That 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 people can compare Meek's flow. To the original PD crack flow. That's dope. That's I think that's dope, man. I don't think I don't you think... give it up for that one. Time? Yes, I yes, I do. Yay! Yes, I do. Okay, so now, boom. Everything is out the way. Out the way. Let's go, baby. About to spark that. We have yeah, please spark it. So we have to get into this conversation. Man, I thought we just got out of conversation. <laughs> oh, my bad. <laughs> Next my week. bad. No, because this is what's been going on. It's been Can people saying... I'm not great at this. Uh, I don't know. I, I'll, I'll spark it for you. Right, my bad. I no problem. I'll, do you. I'll be your yeah. assistant. I just didn't want you to start that mm-hmm. without that lit. Not mm-hmm. yet. You got that lit when mm-hmm. you get into this. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. Let's go, Danny. So, I want to get into this conversation because in this industry, a lot of times when people don't make it, or a lot of times when people... Uh, I have excuses. A lot of times people say, I was blackballed. Mm. Like, this person blocked me. This shit happened. I hate that shit. I hate hearing that. Uh, elaborate. Because there ain't that. no such thing. A, a person could attempt to do something, but boy, when you, if you that nigga and you talented, see, fans don't give a fuck with nobody in a position of power we're talking about. Uh, a real fan, you know what I'm saying? He like, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Real shit. Yeah. Fans don't give a fuck about that. So I wouldn't even trip. I never tripped about that. Mm-hmm. Ain't no such thing. Now, if, I don't know if you're referring to like my situation. Cause I'm referring to everybody's situation. Right. Anybody who ever been because, accused of that. I know, I know it is people out there that will try to that will block the door. Don't even have right. to intentionally block the door. It's just that if a motherfucker that they fucking with know that know that you didn't did some nut shit with them, like that, like right. you ain't fucking with them. Right. And they in that position, they ain't in it. They know better than they like, yo, I ain't in. I had niggas stop me and be like, like, no, nah, crack, I fuck with you, but come on, bro, I can't do that here. Cause you know what I'm saying? Right. I'm like, all right, I could dig it. All right, right. I ain't trying to lose your little job or right. get, you know what I'm saying? Niggas right. shit, niggas relationship. But that's not blackballing, that's just choosing that's, a side. No, 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 that's blackballing, because it'd be <laughs> okay. certain places right, where you gotta go that might not the outlets. Well, as an example, not them, but not to say yeah. anything happened with them, yeah. but like BET. Okay. Might not be at coming to the awards, you know what I'm saying? No invite because you going through some shit with a nigga like they're like, nah, he he got parts. Well, that's black nigga ball. might have ownership in this shit. Okay. Niggas be having owner, you know, no niggas be having no, I'm ownership. Asking, I'm asking because, relationship because you know why I'm asking? Because me personally, I was banned from the tunnel. The college club from New York City, when New York City was the shit. When mm-hmm. we was the shit, I was banned from the tunnel. Mm-hmm. I still made it. That's I was a little blackball. I was banned. Yeah, that's considered. I, that's but that's a form uh, of blackballing. Yeah, yeah but, that is but I, I worked around it. Then I was also uh, 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 banned from Hot 97. It's a shootout yeah, happened but, in front of Hot 97. Uh, I wasn't even there. But hold up, they blame me. But no, but we saying the black one thing. I worked not, around it. Not the places where the things happen and shit like that. I'm just saying, say if it's just a neutral place like Hot 97, right? right. And we ain't got no problem. Ain't nothing happened. Right. But they uh. They need this nigga on this to come on this show really crazy, and y'all got issues, and he ain't gonna go on there, y'all, if he if you come. 
You feel me? Like, okay, like if you, I, okay. if they had me, meaning, you, they, meaning, I, this is like meaning. You saying if you had issues, like if you had issue with Jewel Santana, like back in the days, right. you, you you made a disc record as show an with Jewel. example. So now Jewel well, has a Jewels. show, big 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 him up. Yeah. Jewel has a show, and then they call Jewel and they say, Yo, well, Jewel says, well, I'm not gonna do the show if PD crack. That's a form. That's, that's, that's what black. That's the that's okay. the definition. Big up to Jewel Santana. Hold no your doubt. Hand. But I was just using him as an example. Yeah. Right, y'all, y'all yeah, that's what yeah, I thought I thought that's where he was going. No, no, but but. But so, I still, I, I can understand that that's blackball, right? I can understand that. But this is not what I'm addressing. All right, you got to be the conspiracy that is blackballing. The conspiracy of it, like, mm-hmm. I've been around Jay many a times. I've been around Nas. I've been around Puff Daddy. I have never been around them niggas. Them niggas say yo, don't fuck with this nigga. <laughs> Like, they never well, said that I, I, to me. I just explained that they, they don't have to say it. When the mm. people know, you know what I'm saying? When it's known, like, you know what I'm saying? They don't got so to you say saying it. If you, if, uh, you're saying if you diss Puff Daddy, right? Let's right? suppose mm. you diss Puff Daddy yesterday. Right. Then you, you would think you wouldn't be on this show today. That's it right there. They okay. know better. Okay. They wouldn't even consider it. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But you do know you had a, a, a whole mixtape dissing Jay-Z. Correct? No, I never had a whole mixtape this in Jay-Z. I thought it was you. I never that was never my mixtape. Okay. But somebody did put out there it was right. some they try to put that out. They there. put your now, name. I've had on my it. issues with Jay. Right. But what you talking about, that mixtape cover, the camel shit and all of that. Oh, that was that's, oh, okay, that wasn't my, my doing. I apologize. But okay. I guess it made sense to put make that mine too once I had my issues, but that right. wasn't me right there. Okay. We never made a mixtape. Uh, uh, yeah. That's real. But this is what I'm trying to say is for, for, for our, our particular situation, mm. a lot of people, because we just made a deal, I don't know if you know, we made a deal with, with Vault, we made a deal with Title, and we made a deal with Mass Appeal. A lot of. Which is, was a three, because we wanted to Jay own our shit, we wanted to own our shit, we wanted to be, right. you know, um, and the thing is, our people actually, you know, the same position. So as soon as they said that, people was like, yo, these niggas are Illuminati, these dudes are doing that. Right. So if that was the case, you would be on the black wall list. Would you think so? If that was, if this was really a conglomerate of everybody's together against the niggas that's not uh, with them, then you you would be on that list because of your your past discrepancies. You didn't go to the B sides where they cleared it up, right? So, yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, of course. Yeah, basically. Okay. Yeah, All you right. put it in a weird format to do it up. <laughs> like, <laughs> and I'm like, hold up, but I got no, it though. You feel right, saying? You buy yeah. around the corner. What I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, <laughs> yeah. what I'm saying is, you're my friend. No doubt. I want to get you, give you a platform to speak. If it was something crazy, mm-hmm. and it was really something like that. You wouldn't be here because people yeah. would think I but, my boss. Ba- basically, if Jay owned this shit. It would be an issue. <laughs> yo, yo, you'd be like, hold up, crack. Let me make a call real quick. Actually, we didn't make a call. No, I'm just saying as an example. Not, not. Well, not I'm giving you the real right? example. The real example is we own our show and we okay, do what the fuck we want to do. Made a deal with them. We made a deal with them. They are distributors. They are, but they can't say what we can and cannot no, do. I've always got that because vibe. Because if they could, if you would think. Right. Then you wouldn't. Then you know they what I'm saying. Because, I always got that vibe. So that's what I'm trying to say. I'm just trying to make a point because not only are you my friend, and not only we have a bigger platform, but I also want to make people know that sometimes when you don't make it in life, it's just because you ain't making it in life. Don't blame another nigga. Like you right. ever see? You ever see? You know what's the worst niggas in the world? The dudes that don't leave the hood, yeah. and they be like, they, they never left the hood. They be like, you know why? Nigga, Marcia ain't never motherfucking come get me. Like, what the fuck you talking about Marcus for? Like, you know, nigga, you 41. You 41. You talking about Marcus? Like, Marcus supposed to bring you to Germany, do some in 1991? And you still, like, like, you know what I'm saying? That's the worst thing. So that's what I'm trying to say is, at the end of the day, I don't, I don't really know if blackballing exists or not. I can't really tell you. I can tell you that I was blacklisted. Okay. I don't know if that's. I don't know. Uh, no, I'm no, trying to think. No, no, nah. no and because, it does exist. It does exist. Hold oh, oh, me out. Hit me out. Because blacklisted is he can't come to this club. Yeah, it's a, to it's me, blackballing is he can't See, come to the city. More, you are losing on a whole come. different level right now. All right. So no, that's not true. You're not really suffering from that shit. No. That's not true. I've been, no. I've been, I've been blackballed more than you. If that's I'm saying, the case. but right now everybody okay. loves Nori. 
That's you now. Don't have to worry that's about. now, nigga. But right that's yeah, now, nigga. Nice 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 so what? The trenches nice don't matter yeah, now. Do the, when I was in the trenches, it don't matter. When I was banned from no, fucking every matter. club, you know how I discovered reggaeton? I was banned from every black club in New York City. Oh shit! <laughs> I had to go to the Spanish club, nigga. I remember, nigga. You think I wanted to be? You think I wanted to go? Oh, 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 he go out, nigga. I didn't believe him. Come on, man. I had no choice, nigga. Really That's the only club I can go to, nigga. The, and I ain't never complaining about this. This is the first time I ever said that yeah. in life. Let it out, I was banned from all black clubs in New York City, my nigga. Them niggas had my picture like I stole some. <laughs> like crazy. when you like when you walk to the club, niggas like this. This nigga, uh-uh. Uh-uh. And then it's crazy. It's crazy because the niggas that I was with that was actually doing shit, they would get in the club with no problem. <laughs> They don't care about them. They're like, it's this nigga. You know what I'm saying? So I've been black boy. I didn't mean all that. But my point is, what the point that Nas made, if you can let them black boy you, mm. you're not meant for this game. No doubt. And that's real. Or shit. if they can black ball you, you are meant for this game. I definitely didn't get that one. I'm just saying, <laughs> if you're oh, working man. black balls, oh, okay. yeah, you ain't. Hey, okay. motherfucker, you work yeah. this game. Yeah, so look, I really don't be worried about that shit at all. No, man. no, I just... I never I'm, looked at that. Like, I'm, I never really invest a lot of uh, energy into that. You know what I mean? I do think of that. It is a thing, mm -hmm. but at, I, like I said the first time, like when it comes with the fans... Like, I've still been doing shows ever since. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, if you think about it, pardon me, pardon me, mm -hmm. you, if you think about it, Steve Stout told me to my face mm -hmm. on our show. He was like, I didn't think you went hard. <laughs> like, that was like a <laughs> that was like a version of Black Ball. You this said, is, who said that? Steve Stout. Oh, okay. Yeah, nigga, yeah, that nigga stood right here. Oh, right on the show? Yeah, on yeah, the yeah, show. I, I remember. Let him know. I, he said, I, remember I, said, I said, yo, I said, yo, Stout, I used to think you should be hating on me, and I used to think, like, you ran... And he he looked at me in you my face. You might have delivered it the wrong way. You might have nah, brought that. Nah, nah, nigga. I think that nigga nah, believes he believes it. That. He, he believes, believes it. He believes that. Nigga, that nigga, that you might have brought that response, We had 50 right niggas around him. Nah, he he had, it. He this was not it. the time to lie. And he looked nah, at he me. Nah, he ain't lying, no, but you might have brought that out of him. Like, he like, you know what, man? You know what it was? me like that? You know what it was? He was comparing me to Nas. I got down with the crew. And he wanted my lyrics to be like, no one lyrics could be like, Nas, stop. You got to relax. But he told me. That's why... Yeah. You know, he he said something uh, not great about Cole Megan. He said something not great about AZ. And I, I, I welcome to the, them to this uh, format, right. uh, the platform. No but what a lot of people don't realize, he said that shit to my face. Mm -hmm. That nigga said, I said, like, yo, damn, stop. You should never show me love. He's like, he said, because I didn't think you, you used to go hard. <laughs> That's basically saying, nigga, I think you whack, nigga. Uh, like, but you know what? I gotta give him. I gotta give him his fucking. You know, I gotta. If that, that's what you feel, I don't care. I don't want to force your opinion. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? But um, let me what's switch. Up? Let me switch gears. Yeah, switch gears, man. Let me switch gears for a second. Come on, man. Who was somebody that was a fan of you that you 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 you, you never would have thought? Um. I met Mariah Carey one day. Damn. She didn't spit my shit to oh, me. God damn it. I know. That fucked me God up. God damn it. She smells like mangoes. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. She God knew, damn it. Mangoes are no, like, She knew my shit. Like, God damn it. Like, she knew Mariah. my shit. I didn't think she would. Mm. And I was like, oh, it's PD Crack. She was like, oh, yeah. One for PD Crack. And yeah. I was like, oh, all right. Bet. One for, she, wait, she knew one for PD Crack. She knew the hard shit. Two for free. <laughs> she knew one no, for PD Crack. No, she ain't knew that. I swear that. to God. Go on her. So she was spitting. Word. Hey. I was at a birthday party with Dame and shit. Mm. And he bring me in. He like, yo, come on, nigga. Yo, we was in quiet, I think. In quiet. Why? Yeah, so I'm in a session and shit, and Dame come in. He like, yo, crack, come in. We get on the elevator. He like, I'm where we going? He like, just come on, man. Right. We go upstairs, we get to the top floor and shit. Uh -huh. When we step out, the studio was just a big ass party and shit. Mm. Like a little private party, mm. I guess, a little studio party. Mm. Anyway, he's like, well, come here, man. I walk over there. He's like, oh, Mariah, you know, Mariah, him and Mariah was tight. Yeah, definitely. He's like, oh, this PD Crack right here. Mm. You, you know what PD Crack is? She's like, hell yeah. One for PD Crack and two's for free. <laughs> she knew that shit. <laughs> Spicy <laughs> on that shit. Man, so. Go ahead, light a bogey, man. Go Let's ahead. go. Go ahead, light a bogey. You ain't got to go outside. Shoot him. Where, this, where the bogey's at? All right, I guess. I'll smoke a cigarette, man. All right, so share, state property yeah. kind of breaks up. Mm -hmm. Everyone's doing their own thing. Now, Bean's going up a big rant about 
about Jay Z. Right. Where were you at in your mind when when that's happening? <laughs> like you, you, I'm saying, I'm asking because I don't really know. Like I really don't know. Like you for it or you sitting back? Like because you, you know, when you was beefing with Hov, Beans wasn't. wasn't I was locked wasn't up. When that, I was locked up when this happened though. So I was listening from the radio and shit. Okay. And I don't you know what. I, don't I believe know Beans I, did an uh, interview with Charlemagne the God. Yeah. Something like that, and then Charlemagne mm-hmm. got fired. Shit was real. Oh, I don't know, man. I swear. Look, I was, I was, shit got no, real. Look, I know shit it might seem fan. like Go ahead. it might seem like I should have been paying attention to that right. kind of shit back then, but I wasn't, man. For right. some reason, I didn't know. I knew just as much as the next nigga knew. Right. I wasn't like in it, like you know what I'm saying. Mm. It seemed like I would be in it, right? But no, I wasn't like that tuned into it. Mm. Just because, but we, you did hear about it. I heard about it. Yeah, I heard the freestyles and shit like that. And how did you feel? Because you know those are your two big brothers, correct? I was probably, I was really probably looking, just looking like, what the fuck is going on? Like, right? Honestly, like not even, not even rooting for it, no either side. Good looking, bro. Uh huh. Not even rooting for either side. I mean, like, like even wanted to go. No way at all. I'm like, yo, what is y'all like? How how is this gonna play out? Because it had to be different when Beans was battling. Kids. That's a situation where you look at like, how do this play out? Word. You know what I'm saying? Because of their relationship. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, I agree. You know what I mean? Because like, you can't go like that. Some things can't be done like that. Like, mm. so I don't know, man. Anyway, mm. I didn't want to speak on that shit. Like, you okay, all these good niggas. Get but then, but the then you seen them, you, seen, you seen them together at the B sides. It had to, it had to, huh? that had to bring something good to you when you I seen wasn't them together. There. I mean, but you saw it. I don't think I, I didn't see that. I was locked up around that time. The B sides? How long? That shit. Just, come on, B sides was like yesterday, nigga. Oh, I thought you were talking Like when Jay brought them all out. Yeah, he brought he brought. Oh, um, I swear, I swear to God, I didn't even say about that. Oh. That just happened? No, because he did the other B sides, or what? Uh, I believe Cameron and Nas. But that was recent. Yeah, that was I last year. I swear to God, I'm so out of it. I ain't even, I'm out of and tune. And then the year before shit. that, he brung in beans. He brung in beans. Like yeah. That's the first time seeing them together. Yeah, maybe. I'm just not familiar with that name, but I don't know. Well, anyway, the B-sides. Oh, okay. Never heard of it. <laughs> but is, is, it, is, it, is, it, is it a part of you that ever wanted to be like, you know, <laughs> you want to squash it or make things right? Not squash it, maybe just make things right. Um, I want things to go how they supposed to go. You know what I'm saying? Mm. How they supposed to go. Now, squashing shit is always good, but it ain't nothing to squash. Time squashes shit. That's true. You know what I'm saying? Like, That's if true. it ain't nothing that deep. Now, if a nigga killed your homie or something, ain't nothing, mm. time ain't going to do nothing for that. Mm-hmm. I'm talking about a little rap shit like this, and little discrepancies and little miscommunications and shit. Mm. Time over a while, niggas, I'm straight. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> over bad. a while, it's all good. My bad. Every every like thirty minutes you gotta try me though. Yeah, I try I him every thirty minutes for every thirty like, years. Every like so. fifteen to twenty. <laughs> right. Every fifteen to twenty, he yes. got to touch you, try your chin like. Hmm. Right. But yeah, over time. Hey, your man, ringer knows how to turn off, right? Listen, I, listen. I'm planning in my Nori weekend in case y'all don't know. September, <laughs> going on? September fourth to the ninth. September fourth is my um, anniversary. Married to my beautiful wife. And your birthday's right around. And the then corner. my birthday September sixth. That's so crazy. If y'all around. You know what I'm saying? Come through Miami. I'm going to either go to Hawaii before or <coughs> Hawaii, after. Miami? Oh, when's your birthday? Uh, my birthday is September 6th. Oh, yeah. We're when's going yours? September. August, August? No, I'm on September 25th. September 25th. Yeah. Okay, that's right. Hey, I'm one year older than you, though, right? Or you got I'm, me by a year? Nah, um, I'm born in 77. I'm 77. Okay, yeah. So I got you by a couple of days. I'm September 6th. And then uh, you the 26th, you said? The 25th. 25th. So yeah, I got you for like 20 days or something uh, like that. Like 19 man. days. That's you know what I'm saying? Like that. Yeah, we the same yeah. age and shit. You know what I'm saying? God damn it, man. I'm 75. I signed this autograph back in the day. You went from 75. Yeah. What up? <laughs> Yo, nigga, definitely signed the autograph. I'm glad you believe it now. I'm like, yo, yeah. think it won't believe me. I'm <laughs> telling you. Yeah. I'm like, I don't got it no more. I wish I could find it. So yeah. Yeah. No, they be um, I told them, like, yo, I met this nigga back when I was a kid when T-O-N-Y came out. Mm. And I just randomly, we was watching shit on Rap City so much. I was like, yo, let's go get the CD. I hopped on a bus and right. shot downtown and went to go get the CD. Right. And as I'm walking in the record store, I swear to God, oh, my mom, nigga. Right. I pulled the door open. And we going to get the CD. Right. I pulled the door open. I opened the door for him. Right. Like, 
And he walked by. He like, good looking, man. Walked by. I'm like, oh, shit. I'm like, yo, that's him. That's Nori right there. Right. Wait, but right. if you're a kid and y'all are the same age. Yeah, but he's nah, nah, nah. We back when I was we a both kid was too. kids. He yeah, was yeah, on, I was still a kid. No, no, I know. That's what I'm saying, though. No, we didn't mean yeah. like we both wasn't kids. Right. We just going back. It was a while ago. Right, right. It's, it's, it's not third now. shot. Third what, shot. When did Tony come out? When did T.O.L.Y. Uh, 95. 90s, no, no, 97. 96. No, all I was in 97, 97 nigga. 97. 97. Oh, really? 97, yeah. Right? Yeah, 96. Officially? Was, yeah. Well, you asked Yeah, 97. Damn, yeah. I'm off. Yeah, trust me. 97. No, no, no. How I don't know was, what happened how, yesterday. Yo, how, I know old what happened you, how old was you when um, T.O.N.Y. came out? Uh, 97, well... 20. Yeah, 20. Yeah. All right, so that's that's still that was young. spicy. Tell you know what I'm saying, especially the where and we I, at now. I met you in late '97. Yep. Yeah. Yep. You, right before N O R E album. Because you were promoting yeah. that yeah. project. Yep. The uh, Capone Noriega project. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Going into N O R E. So y- getting into this game, if you had a chance to do it all over, what would you do? What would you do over? Um, I don't think about do-overs, man, for some reason. I be feeling like everything really happened the way it's supposed to happen. All right. Because you learn so much shit. What if it's shit that... You learn a lot of shit from when bad shit happened the most. You don't learn too much from when shit going good because when shit going good, shit go your way. Mm. But the hardship, it's like when shit don't go your way, you got to learn how to get out this problem. Yo, come on, man. You feel me? This nigga over here being disrespectful. You got pouring <laughs> shots like you a kitty cat. <laughs> Fuck. Man, you drinking that much, dog? Yes. Salute, be crack. This is your day, baby. Like you gotta give you your flowers. You gotta give you your flowers while you're alive, brother. Hello, bro. We wanna tell you to your face. Come on. Got that. What the heck? Let me add you something, though, baby. Let me tell you to your face. While you're alive. High five. Yeah, that's what you said. you alive. How, how great you are, man. Wait, was that Prince? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, Michael Prince, Jackson? Prince been, haunting, <laughs> Prince been haunting me for years. <laughs> so we want to tell you to your face, man. We appreciate you, man. You're a real nigga. We got your back. And we motherfucking, you, my man. nigga. Let's make some noise. Be crack. Hold on, let me. No, 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 no. I, 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 just, I took a piss. I got like two more questions. Oh, so what the fuck was that? I, I need to take a piss, ending? nigga. I need to take a piss, nigga. No, no, let's go. Wait, wait. I got a question for you. You didn't make an intro when you went your tickets. What's good? Let him go walk away from the piss. Hip hop. Give me the origins of the name. Because you got two names. Yeah. What's two names you know? Petey Petey is one and Petey Crack. Yeah. Well, well, Petey Petey always been just... just I'm just saying. I'm just speculating. Go ahead. Who are you? Oh. Nobody. No, no. That's my thought right now. Look, hey, no, look. The Petey Crack came from... Um, I ain't never talked about this. I swore I talked about this already. I see. We've been on here so many times. I don't even know. Listen, what, what everybody shit. that listens and watches is just like yeah, us. So we, we still, got drunk facts. Still got to forget everything. It. Right. I got you. All right. So the Pete crack, the PD crack came from like the movie uh, Carlito's Way with the nigga Benny Blanco from the Bronx. Yeah. Cause my name used to be PD Crack O. You know what I'm saying? PD Crack O. So one of my rhymes, no, but one of my rhymes I said used to call me Benny Blanco like PD Crack O. And after that, everybody from my hood just start saying PD Crack. Where PD Crack go at? And then I just cut the O off. All right? But this was roughly around the same time that, uh, you know, Fat Joe always been Joey Crack. So it just, uh, made, it just made it seem just like... Did you and Fat Joe ever have beef over there? No. <laughs> I, I, went, I went straight in. I went straight in. Yeah, no, it's good. No, we never had no beef over it. I know that he didn't. He was he was feeling some type of way at some time. Mm. But he's he told I seen him interview free and he told free like, yeah, man, I, I fuck with crack, man. But it's just that at the time man, with the with the name and mm. shit. I was like, what's up with little homie, man? He thought I was just straight jacking the name. Mm. I understand now because if a nigga come out and call himself crack now mm. in this era, I'll be like, yo, who the fuck is this little nigga? Mm. Like that name ain't that name off limits. That's how right. you feel as a rapper. You be like, yo, you take my name, nigga. Mm. Yeah, you know, this some shit. This mm. some you know, he from the Bronx. There's no right. Philly the same way. Like, hold oh, that's my name. It's like. Especially niggas that used to tag and shit. Right. That name, they feel oh, yeah. some shit about their name. Oh, hell That's yeah. a battle. Like, you oh. know what I'm saying? Gary, <laughs> play on the name. The fuck is that? Right. Where I come from? Nah, because I'm thinking about battling. Like, that's why. I, was, I, right. thought, I thought thinking well, about the times start, I lost. That is started uh, battle, right. though. No, that's real. Word. But yeah, man, it ain't, it ain't no thing, though, man. He know he the OG, man. I used to rush home to go uh, catch some show. He used to come on like 3 o'clock at the school. 
Mm. Um, and it would play You Got Flow Joe. It had to play the video. Yeah. That's the only time I get to see the video. It was vid. just the anniversary of that. It was a haul ass right. home. That's it. Come on, bust it, check it. Watch out, wreck it. That was my shit. Right, that's hard. That was all That's hard. That's hard. Yeah, man. Shout out to Joey Crack. Man. Hit that, hit that, hit that. That's your man. That's your man. That's your man. So what? What's next for P P Crack? What's next? Like, um, are we are we are we coming out with a new group? You know? Nah. Honestly, man, I like I like the artist part of it. You know what I'm saying? But uh, you know, as you get older and shit, you start to get more interested in the, uh, the more important things of it. You know what mm. I'm saying? Like the artist part, I was more just competitive, and that's all I was focusing on, just being dope. But then mm. they got to a point, not to, not to be all braggadocious, but right. I got so ill to myself that I was like, yo, that's a, that's enough. Like, I'm not right. I'm not competing. I'm like, I'm not, it's not a challenge no more. You know what I'm saying? With all people. Right. You know what I'm saying? With artists, with other rappers. You know what I'm saying? Right. To me. You know what I'm saying? Just like, I think that era of rappers that I admired that made me want to rap like that is kind of gone right now. Once in a while, I hear some niggas that rap like that. J. Cole get busy. Wait, is the other nigga, um, example, the little light-skinned nigga, YBN something? Oh, yeah, yeah, he yeah yo, he crazy, he too. He, yeah, he, yo, he, he, crazy. he, he, he look, he crazy look a little crazy, but... But check like, it. Yeah. But look. Do you get beyond, like, that, that, like he got, he yeah, got that, rubber that bands in his ear? Yeah, that a little bit, Like, but, I did the rubber bands? Nah, but you pay attention to what they but he's he's crazy. Yeah, once he start rocking... Just take the rubber bands out. Once he start rocking, though, he just be spitting. All right. But I like him. I like him. He's hard. He but yeah, when they get to that point, man, I'm like, yo, yeah, who, fuck who else you like? That's a good question. Who else do I like? I'm yeah. fucking up. It's okay. uh, um, right now, who else I like right now? Yeah. Oh man, that's always a hard question, man. I can't fucking remember who I like right now. I like, oh. I like, I like, I like J Cole now, and I didn't like J Cole for a while. I never listened. I ain't gonna say I ain't like him. I never, that, I never listened. My bad. The fucking yeah. ass. When Don't I worry about it. it. We'll make it happen. Go ahead. Uh, Continue. But yeah. I never I never listened, but now I like him now. Um J. Cole. Yeah, I like J. Cole right now. Who no young dog. No, you tripping. No. No, I like I like the young boy Key Glock. <laughs> I like Key Glock. Key Glock, that's a good that's down Dolph, with young dog. That's yeah. Dolph little I'm brother. On point. I like him. Y'all ain't fucking with Big Crit. Big Crit got a new joint. Big Crit Big Crit Hall. Crit, 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 Crit always Crit been hard. Yeah. He did right, he, he belong with you. We ain't gonna get into that though. What I'm telling you is, is No, that, I asked you that. Why are we ain't gonna get into it? Because I can't really name all of the people that I like. <laughs> Alright, cool. Should we take another shot and then you maybe think about it? Not a time. Nope. I'm just going to forget even more. <laughs> nah, right, my bad. Right. I'm just trying to, you know. No, you, know, you good. Keep you must... in the flow, bro. But yeah, no, we, uh, yo, you fucking the flow up. Huh? <laughs> 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 these shots, these shots is not, they're not helping. That's not the motivation that we're looking for. This <laughs> is <an> anti motivation. <laughs> That's not the motivation that we're looking for. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. We I just good. enjoy hanging with you. I enjoy uh, cold so. water, or something. Yeah, yeah. Like no, cold, no, 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 cold water shots. No, we're looking for water shots. Uh, yeah, would you like to switch up the shot? How about that? We're like watermelon syrup. I don't like the the watermelon. I, I like the black. I like the black one. You don't like that one? Yo. We are, I, I ain't gonna lie to you. I the watermelon is kind of sweet for me. Too uh, extra sweet. I compromise. What's up? You take a shot of the black. Yeah, you gonna take a shot of the watermelon. Let's yeah. go. Right, Cause I'm like that. black, black. I like watermelon. How dare you be black and not like <laughs> not that shit, watermelon? I, like, I, I eat a lot of watermelon fruit, but you don't fuck with watermelon syrup. Maybe I need somebody to mix me up. Advertise this shit right now. Like this go is ahead. the best. <coughs> nah, okay, you can never have. Everybody loves it. We we are promoting everything. So yeah. now let me just tell you something. What's good? So have, so you felt at one point you were blackballed or no? No. Or you just <laughs> felt like we went back to that. No, because you know why I want to be clear. No, you know I don't want to nah. feel like I left anything unturned. No, I never felt that way. You sure? Yeah, I never felt that way. Okay. I mean, I, I'm sure I've never felt that way. Right. I don't know. It might. Anything's possible, but right. I'm, I'm sure I ain't. Because feel that I'm way. sure it's times like. I don't know if this. I'm just giving you a bad example. I'm sure it's times probably somebody will probably try to diss you, and Beans will probably say, "Well, I ain't fucking with them." He should. Yeah, that's what you should say. So right. that's what you would expect. Right. Yeah. So, but there's that black ball in that then. Oh. Or, yeah. On that level, yeah. On that level. Okay. Yeah, I definitely don't. You speaking that. artist to artist, but yeah. We can, oh we can, no! 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 no. Gonna do me like that? Wash my glass out. I don't want water like a bone, brother. Nah, uh, you ain't gonna do 
going to do that to the young thing? Uh uh-uh. uh. Do you understand that Tiger Ball no, don't go with nothing? Just in time. That shit don't go. You don't want you don't wash this shit out. I'm not gonna have any. You you know I'm saying wash this shit. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Say it once. It's my man. Got the ugliest car in the universe, right? Yo, his car. Let me tell you something. His car got roaches in it. No, no. They're his Pull, friends. Pulled up on the yard. I thought he had lights, right? Petey Crack. Like, cause shit was just moving. Like, you know, like, you know, back in the days, you know, you get in a limo and the shit just be moving. So you like, oh, okay. So, so, my nigga right in. I walked in the spot. Diego said, oh my God, he got, a, he got roaches. I said, holy moly guacamole. I'm hoping my friend is exaggerating. He was not! <laughs> yeah, the Roach in car, cousin? Roach Yandex. No, he didn't did have it. He yo, has yo, it. Yo, Roach Yandex is walking through his shit. Know, you know, you, you, you just got cranberry. Be good. And that, uh, what's that? Blackberry. Thanks, you got Blackberry. You got the good. I have. You, 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 you want the Tiger Bone? You don't mind? No, yeah. You don't mind? Give me that Blackberry. Come on. So, look. Look. So I'm just giving you an example uh, of what go, type man. of nigga this nigga is. Uh, so I also <laughs> looked in the back and I seen a dead dwarf. A dead no. What the fuck? <laughs> From Cinderella and the Red Rider Hood. Cinderella. Yo. Cinderella. I killed that. Cinderella. <laughs> I killed that. Uh, Yo, no wait for me, Greg. What the fuck are you doing? That's it. All right, all right let's go. Salute. Yeah. Salute. So you, you know, nobody made one? me a drink. Yo, this is no, 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 hold on. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Hold on. What do you want? So we got another one. Apparently, Leo fucked with me. All right, yeah. Do another one. Give, 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 hold on, hold on. Wait for us. Un poquito. I ain't gonna lie. Too much shit here. P. Crack, I'm, I'm gonna tell you your future right now. What's going on? You winding up. And uh, I was gonna say take one, but what's the new shit? Booby trap on the river. <laughs> I don't know. That's what where that you're gonna is. want. You're gonna know oh, later. Man, you're gonna no. know later, nigga. You in Miami, nigga. No, you, you drunk? Forgetting. No, you be forgetting Salud. how I Salud. do this shit. Now though. I'm going home, nigga. I'm married and loyals. Black men don't cheat. <laughs> Salud. Uh, I got one more left in me. I got one more left in me. No. That shit is good. You can stop that shit. That shit is stop good. Stop that shit. Man. Yo, I don't know if y'all know, but that watermelon of rock comes it from Jesus. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. That shit comes from Jesus. Black raspberry. Can, give me another round, please. I'm in. <laughs> and then I gotta go get some lobster skewers. Give mine to Sunny. Oh, which one? You said black raspberry. You meant the watermelon. No, I, I'm, I ain't fuck with black raspberry. So sorry. No, you said that. So sorry. But that watermelon, that. I, I fuck with okay, watermelon. Okay, though. All right. okay, yeah. I like the black raspberry. I'm about to be some fried chicken. I'm ain't nothing wrong with us. Live, like, with live a shit. straight stereotype right now. I'm about to be the straight stereotype. Hey, so far, give me a little more. I'm in. Give me a little more. I'm a grown ass man. Put it to the top, fucker. Not the top. All right, that's it. I'm a grown ass man. Give, give Twin a shot. How dare we look over him? Yes. Gracias. We treat him like an equal. Yes. We're going to push him down the steps, too. <laughs> just, just like we're going to push Sonny down. You know, we're going to do the same shit. Everybody equal whites, baby. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Pete Crack, you good? You, you want to smoke some more? Come on, man. No, Loosen up? up, man. You listen, man. Done. What you, you want me to do? You want to do a backseat? <laughs> You, you family, man. Get some more black raspberry, man. I, I it, it, it doesn't rain Real in please. Southern California. I don't know why I thought of 2020 20, 20 right now. Yeah, what's that at all? Uh, yeah, come what on. Because it doesn't rain in Southern nah, We're not. We're in Miami, that's, though, that's man. That's not the way it, it works, man. It definitely rains in Miami. This nigga Pete Crack is a grown man, man. Let me treat him like that. You disrespect him, man. You disrespectful to him. Let me call that for him, man. I got Pete Crack. I know I know who you are in real life. I know who you are in real life. Come on, come on, man! You got your shot. Yo, listen, P. Crack, you're my friend. I want to give you roses, your right. flowers while you're here. No I don't doubt. want anything to happen to you. And then no I'll be like, yo, you know what? P. Crack was my nigga. I want to tell it to your face. No doubt. We celebrate hip hop here, and today we celebrated you. No doubt. And your shirt and your tattoos match, <laughs> <laughs> and we love it. Salute. Hey. Oh. Taking a picture. Ah.